guys, this is Jean from Happy Indulgence and welcome to my channel. I wanted to start recording these weekly reading vlogs just to talk a bit about what I've been reading, what I've been doing, a bit about my life and yeah, whatever ha comes up that week. I have been trying to put at least one video a week on my channel. Uh, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of them. So a bit about what I've been doing this week. I just came back from watching Thor Ragnarok yesterday and oh my gosh it was so funny I really didn't expect it to be because the last two movies weren't really that humorous but oh my gosh it was so good yeah I just loved how random it was and the scenes where they were shooting in New York was actually in Brisbane which is where I live and I did get to see them filming there as well so that was pretty cool even though it was from quite far away yeah so if you haven't seen it I would really really recommend it uh, another thing that's happened this week is that uh, my hip really started hurting. I've kind of been ignoring it and I finally went to the physio and she told me that I had actually tore my hip flexor. Yeah, so that's why it was giving me so much pain, especially when sitting down at work. So that's not good, but I actually tore it because I was hiking and walking like 10 to 13 kilometers a day when I was overseas in Hawaii. So yeah, I really hope it heals soon because I I'm on so many painkillers at the moment and it is hurting a lot. Yeah, other than that, I think that's what I've been up to. I did get some book mail, so I'm just going to open that at the moment. I think I know what it is. I'm so excited. This is the collector's edition of A Darker Shade of Magic by V.E. Schwab. Oh my gosh, it is so beautiful. Here's some guest art. My friend Creamy, who's a, also a blogger, actually hand lettered that and it is absolutely stunning. I have read A Darker Shade of Magic but I haven't read any of the other books and I really really need to because I really love the first one even though I can't remember too much about it. I've heard that it just gets better and better with every book. Toby, go away! Go on! Go away! So on to what I'm currently reading. I haven't actually been reading too much this week because I've been really addicted to Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. It's just this game where you make friends with animals and you buy them presents and yeah, you build furniture so they'll visit you. It, it's actually a lot better than it sounds, but it came out early in Australia, so we've all been addicted to it and probably not reading as much as we should. What I'm currently reading is The Reader by Tracy Chi. So I've just started, I'm on chapter seven at the moment, but I'm actually really enjoying this so far. So, so far it's about this girl and whose parents were hiding a book and they got killed because of it and now she's trying to hide this book and so that the baddies can't get to her. I think it's really beautifully written so far and yeah, I've heard the magic in here is, real, is really good as well. I'll definitely have more once I read a bit more out of it. This week I also read God's Grave by Jay Kristoff. I just recorded a review about it and I'll have a review up on the blog next week at happyindulgencebooks.com. Oh my gosh, guys, I gave God's Grave five stars. I absolutely loved it. There's so many fantastic twists and turns. It's so stabilicious. There's lots of blood and gore and it's just sarcastic and so much fun. I really loved it as well. So make sure to check out my review once it's up so I'll make sure to link it up here so you guys can check it out and yeah that's God's Grave. On the blog I also reviewed The Language of Thorns by Lee Bardugo which I absolutely loved and also Renegades by Marissa Meyer which I wasn't really a fan of and was actually quite disappointed at so make sure to check out those reviews on the blog I'll link them down below. And I'm also doing a giveaway for Wonder Woman Warbringer by Lee Bardugo. I did enjoy reading this book, but it was about a three star read for me, but I didn't find it as good as I had hoped. So I'm actually giving my copy away. My giveaway ends really, really soon. So make sure you visit my blog if you want to enter and it is an international giveaway. I also went to the library this week because I clearly do not have enough books to read and that's something that I always say but lucky I have an understanding husband. So I picked up There's Someone Inside Your House by Stephanie Perkins. I've heard this is a slapstick like horror movie romance novel. 
I kind of feel like reading it because I've heard it's so bad it's good sort of way. I also picked up Jane Unlimited by Kristen Cashaw and uh, I love all time travel YA books for some reason and this one really interested me because I love Graceling which he also wrote. Um, so yeah, I've heard mixed reviews as well, but I'm keen on checking it out. I also picked up Little Monsters by Cara Thomas, and I've actually read The Darkest Corners as well, which was a thriller, and I've heard this one is a gory thriller as well. It's about this girl that's new to the town, and all of a sudden they start welcoming her into a tight circle of friends. But then one of the girls never makes it home from the party, and they start relying on her. So it sounds actually like a super creepy read. I also picked up from the library, Origin by Dan Brown, and I'm actually really keen on reading this one. I love all the Robert Langdon books, they're just a bit of a guilty pleasure. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to reading this. The last book I picked up from the library is Red Sister by Mark Lawrence and I've heard this is a bit like Nevernight because uh, some of my favourite book reviewers have really recommended this one to me and it sounds like it's a, got a bit of a assassin convent feel to it so I'm looking forward to reading this as well. So yes, that is everything that's happened this week at the start of November and yeah, I hope you enjoyed my weekly reading vlog. If you have any comments at all, please leave it down below. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video and subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for checking me out guys. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.